The COVID-19 pandemic has led to a dramatic crisis worldwide. The pandemic has been affecting the entire economic system of the world. Because of this, we want to build back better the world we once lived in. Now that the people are very eager to bring back to life the normal environment, COVID-19 vaccines are introduced rapidly. The vaccines are not experimental since they went through all the required stages of clinical studies. Vaccines are the best way to train our immune system to recognize viruses. Our immune system creates antibodies and other defenses to protect us. When a vaccinated person is exposed to viruses, their immune system will recognize and spring into action to keep them healthy. There are so many vaccines being released by World Health Organization. But here in the Philippines, the top 5 best-selling COVID-19 vaccines are the following. Johnson & Johnson Single Shot, Sinovac, AstraZeneca, Moderna, and Pfizer. It is entirely rational to meet the best vaccine available. But the best vaccine is the one available right now because it stops you from catching COVID-19, reduces transmission to vulnerable members of our community, and reduces the risk of severe diseases. All available vaccines do their job and do it well. The more people get vaccinated, the more the community becomes immune. Every vaccine delivered is a small but significant step towards global immunity. Now that COVID-19 vaccines have been developed, the next major step will be ensuring the people around the world are vaccinated. The government has set out health protocols for us to follow, and I guess that is the best way for me to help prevent the spread of COVID-19, and that is wearing masks and face shields, sanitizing and observing social distancing, and of course, staying at home. Getting vaccinated is very important if we want to save our lives and the lives of others, and I think it's important to prevent the spread of COVID-19 and the further loss of lives. The rumors that said it will just endanger and put our lives at risk is not true. The government is helping and doing their very best to save the lives of the many. That's why they are encouraging us to get vaccinated. And I hope everyone will get vaccinated. We really need to have the COVID-19 vaccine because it will help us to be immunized. It doesn't mean that we will not get infected anymore with the virus, but if we do, we will experience the mild symptoms only, not those that are very, uh, very severe. And that is why we need the COVID-19 vaccine because it will also help prevent the spread of COVID-19 and the further loss of lives. I prefer learning at school because I'm a person who easily gets distracted. That is why the online setup doesn't suit me. When I open my phone to check the Google Classroom for the activities, uh, a message from Messenger pops out. Then I need to go check it out because it might be something important. Then only to find out it's something that it that is isn't. And then I go to check out other apps because I might wonder if there, be, there, there will be notifications that might need to be checked. And that will consume minutes or maybe hours. And I end up getting uh, not completing my assignment. That is why I prefer learning at school. And when you're at school and you're in your face-to-face -face setup, it's better because... You have better interaction with your teachers and your classmates. You can ask questions easily, not, not like um, asking on the messenger where you need to wait for the response and sometimes they won't even reply. And that is why I think it's best to learn at school than at home. I think the one disadvantage brought about by this pandemic to my learning is that we need to uh, learn online and we can't go to school to do face-to-face -face classes. I think it's, dis it's a disadvantage because the learning depends on your Wi-Fi connection, Wi-Fi connectivity. It's sad to hear that some of my classmates have stopped learning, have stopped studying because they can't afford to maintain a, wi a stable Wi-Fi connection. And uh, it's sad to know that 
This has hindered us from reaching our goals, from reaching our dreams to become uh, to become what we want to in the future, in the near future. And, and for me, I have coped uh, with the new normal learning through adjusting. I have I have to um, to be more disciplined disciplined to my studies study habits, and I have to uh, keep up with the new system of learning. And I think we all should if we don't want to stop ourselves from reaching our dreams.